Hey guys, Amy Wood here. We're live outside 7 on Main, getting ready to kick into a Carolina's Family of Four, welcoming Ben Hoover. Hey yes. Ben. Hey, how are you? I'm good. You know, it's chilly out here, but it's it not is. as bad as it could be. But full sun today. It's a gorgeous day all across the upstate. A lot of schools going back after the holiday break. It's just kind of getting back into the swing of things. Yeah, some kids are still going back tomorrow. I think a lot of yeah. Spartanburg County kids are doing that. Uh, it's been interesting to see what's happening with the temperatures because while we have the sunshine, it's not so bad, but let me show you something that's happening happening out on the Swamp Rabbit Trail. We're not exactly sure who's behind this, but take a look. We have a seven camera picture of what somebody's done. They've left these hats behind along the Prisma Health Swamp Rabbit Trail. The Bike Walk Greenville group was out doing the trails this weekend. They took the seven cam shots as they hit the trail. They say the tags on them read, if you're cold, take one which is like such a thoughtful and, and kind thing to do. And so it's totally kind. And so it's a mystery as to who's doing it. We don't know. We yet. don't know. But wow. if you know, let us know on the Facebook page. That would be great. Well, we have a lot going on in the show today. I know a lot of us are trying to get through the first Monday of the year, but check this out. One of the stories we're following today involves um, the Clemson Tigers, right? Everybody's gearing up for the big game. They're seven days away from another national championship, potentially facing off against LSU in New Orleans for that college football national championship. It's also an important month for blood donation centers all across the country. It is National Blood Donation Month. This also happens to be a particular month where they have a hard time getting people in to, to give donations at a critical time. Of course, we're gonna speak to somebody a representative with Blood Connection here today uh, to talk a little bit about how we can all help out get those donations up for the uh, all the different uh, donation centers. It's really important. Also, yeah. it's this time of the year in South Carolina for Restaurant Week. I know everyone's trying to diet, but apparently they don't care. <laughs> they want you to go out and eat at the restaurants, and they're ready to kick this off all across the Carolinas. We'll tell you what you need to know, and we'll have a sneak peek at what you can expect. Plus, we're going to feature uh, one of the newer restaurants in Spartanburg, so it's going to be kind of cool. So stick around for that. Had a gorgeous day all across the upstate. We want to check in with meteorologist Jackie Brown. She's in Spartanburg. She's yes. got a look at what's ahead. Hey, Jackie. Hey, guys. Hey, Amy and Ben. And yeah, why do they have to have restaurant week after the holidays? I'm I like, know. no. But of course, I'll be there. I'm, I'm hungry already. <laughs> All right. Well, let's take a look at our current temperatures right now. We're seeing uh, lots of 50s, 52 Asheville, 59 right now at GSP. And there's